guys, and in this video, I just wanted to give you a few quick updates as to what's going on in my life and uh, um, what's going to be going on in, in the future. I have to start off by saying that, to be honest, the only reason why I'm doing this video is because I, I got an email from someone named Jake asking me why it is that I'm not uploading videos and why it is that I'm not updating my, my, my website. The, the answer to that really is that I um just 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 haven't there's 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 no answer really I I um it's not that I want to stop YouTube or indeed want to stop updating my website I I really enjoy YouTube having an online community and everything that goes with it but to to to, to be to be honest I just haven't had had the inspiration to make YouTube videos my um sort of quintessential response to that used to be that I was um, t too too busy. I had, had, had loads of college work to do to a, towards the end of the year last year, but that finished um, a, a months ago now, and I've been on, been on a holiday for months, just not, 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 not really doing an awful lot, but I still haven't um, found time to do videos. I I just wanted to just, uh, give you a few updates and and maybe maybe through doing that will I'll sort of arrive at a consensus about what I'm doing for videos in the future. I am gonna I am gonna keep doing videos. I'm just struggling to come up with inspiration for them. I um okay. So let's start with a few updates. The first, probably the most important thing to say is that in about I've left. School now, college. I've I've finished my levels. So for you guys, for you guys in the US, I've finished high school, which means I've going I'll be going to university university next year as an undergraduate. I'm studying psychology, um, at at Newcastle, which which if 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 you guys don't know, it's it's a major UK city. It's probably about a, a hundred miles. Or so, a little bit less north from where I live at the moment. It um, it it's a major metropolitan city, and I currently live in the country next to a small market town. So, so just being in the city is going to be a big change. But more more importantly, it will be the first time I've ever lived on my own, away from my parents, having other people care for me. So, so that that's the next change I want to talk about. Currently, I'm having uh, um, other people come to to get get me up in the mornings, put me to bed at night, just to get me ready um, for for that transition. Because I'm going to be uh, um, obviously when we're living independently, my parents are still going to be here, so I I'm going to have to be relying on other people 100% for my care. Um, and sort of, sort of related to that, the next big piece of news since I last did a video is that we're uh, um, se selling selling this house. Um, uh, back last year, we had a number of of fa fam family issues that made made money money tight. But then we and uh, then decided that e even after those issues were resolved, uh, um. My parents couldn't couldn't financially support this house anymore, so we're we're going uh, um we're going we're going to be moving to a, a, a smaller house um at some point in the near future. I'm kind of hoping that the rest of the family don't move house before I leave the unit because if that happens, then I'll have I'll, I'll um have to move from here to a new house and then. And then move to uni, so I'm kind of hoping that, that that doesn't happen in the near future. But we've we've had we've had a lot of success with viewing, so that that looks like it's going in the in the in the right direction, really. And um, what 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 else is there? Well, um, another another sort of aspect of me gets my independence is, is that I, I've. I've Started doing voluntary work. It's 
it's only a couple of days a week at my l local community centre, booking booking people in for view for viewings of films just on just on a basic commu computer system. And but I that's something that I'm doing now to occupy my time and make make myself feel like I'm doing something productive. So th that's good. It'll it'll give me lots of experience to put on my CV at at a, a later date. Um, speaking of a later date, are we going to university on the 14th of September, start on the 16th, and obviously we have an, an induction week for the first three weeks, and then uh, first week, and then uh, lectures start a week after that. I'm extraordin extraordinarily nervous about going, but to sort of try and quell those nerves, I've already started uh, um, reading books for my undergraduate degree and that's what that's what's consumed a um last last around my time today actually I'm I'm just um gonna start looking into the 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 legal legalities of the insanity defence because in the in the introduction to mental health unit that's that's something we have to discuss and if you've seen any of my previous videos I'm very interested in the forensic applications of psychology so I'm just going to start looking looking into the statutes and the case law of when where the insanity law has been applied and and how it's used. Um, that's pretty much my my uh, for today. In 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 other tech news, because um, I am eligible for disabled students' allowances. And because I, I can't write, it means I basically ought, automatically um, are pr provide, provided with, with a laptop for special software on it to help me immune, help me um, uh, be more be more efficient when, when I'm at university. The, 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 it's just a it's just a box standard Toshiba Core i3 chip for. Four gig, four gig, four gigs of RAM. Nothing to talk about there, but it's it's my it's my first um w Windows eight machine, and I'm 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 quite liking it. I I hated it to start off with, but now I just use that Windows eight tile tile interface just to say was I did use Spotlight. Well, when I first got the machine, the people that had set it up put a put a start menu. Uh, replacement arm, but I got I got rid of that because I'm just gonna I uh, decide I want to get used to the the the, the, the Windows 8 architecture. I've um in other cool news I've been been provided with with a scanner which again is just a just a box standard scanner, but but it uh, it has really good OCR capabilities. So if you if you scan a for a form to a computer, I need to need to edit it um it 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 transfers that data rather than just being an Im image into editable editable regions and there's some consumer software that does that but this the this um expensive assisted assisted software that I've provided me does does a really great job um So that 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 is also cool. Um, uh, let me think. What what other news is there? Well, obviously, me having finished high school, I I go to uni on the fourteenth of September. That's that's the day that I actually um the 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 agreement, if you want, for my. For my room in in the the halls of business buildings style, so that's when that's when I'm going. And um, I I I'm going to be living in a li a little area where it's not a flat, but in, in my little area there's it's a bigger building than a flat, but in my little area there's a communal uh, kitchen for a six. The six people that live on that particular corridor. So uh, 
should be a nice um, sense of community there. Um, but I go to get my level results sometime, sometime, sometime in August. Um, so uh, that, that that should be good. Let me think. What else? Oh, oh, oh yeah. Um, since um, you'll have actually seen in our last video, I upgraded to mountain lion and. Um, and in the pro in the process, I had to I had to wipe the system for one reason or another. It caused problems, and I I lost um my copy of Air Life that comes on all all um Mac computers when when you first buy them. So I now don't have a copy of iMovie, which is what I used to rec record videos from my, from my webcam. So I'm currently using my screen recording software, ScreenFlow Free to actually um, record this video even though I'm not using any any screen screen footage. Um, I said a couple of videos back that I that I uh, had bought this software to inspire me to do more videos because I, I thought um the 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 constant mind of how much I spent on it would would um, inspire me to do more videos. That as you can probably as you can work out that that hasn't happened um uh, um it's not it's not it's not that I can't be bothered to do videos or certainly that I don't want to do videos i i, I really appreciate the community it's, it's more a case of i've 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 come around on thinking that that my my perspective on things possibly isn't so, so unique and think about it when 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 there's ever some news coming out, there's um, all the all the all the pop people like techno before soldier knows best who comment on it first, and I feel like ever ever everyone else who comments on it sort of just um, follows on. I I I occasionally do videos like that if I feel like I've got something unique to say, and a lot of the a lot of the Drupal content. Uh, and the web design content is unique to me, at least on YouTube. But I, I struggle to think of what my sort of unique selling point is sometimes. But I, I thank you for sticking with me. And I, as far as what I'm gonna, do, what what I'm gonna do in terms of videos, what, what once I get to university, obviously, I then really I'm gonna have a lot, a lot less time. I have, um, I believe it's eleven hours of talk time. What? A week, but then it's supposed supposed to be a full time job. So you you're supposed to do at least another uh, 30, 35 hours, I think, of of um, reading, which which I I quite enjoy. So I've already bought one of the one of the course textbooks, and I've started um, re re researching it in earnest. So so I'm I'm really I'm really excited um, for the academic challenge, but it. But it is going to take up quite a lot of my time. In terms of the practicalities of uh, doing videos, I am, in addition to the new laptop, taking my own Mac, which will which will stay in my room. So when I come back from that the day, I'll be able to go on the iMac. But but um, oh, obviously, it what what I use this time will be a shared internet connection. You you get. You get broadband as part of the, the, the standard of the rent, but uploading, uploading high videos of a large power size might might not be looked on that favourably with people looking around me. I, I need to, I need to check what the what the fair use policy policy is, and that actually that's a good reminder. Um, as uh, so I think that's pretty much it. Um, this has been a long video, about 15 minutes now, uh, with me just rambling on, but I, I hope it's been interesting for some people. The the videos where I'm talking about my personal life seem to get a bit, a bit more traction than, than my tech videos. I mean, like, like I said, I think 
that is probably because this is a bit more unique than the tech videos. If there are any tech videos you want me to do, then uh, please leave them down in the comments because I do I do want to do them. I just um, struggle for inspiration because when you look around YouTube, it, it, it feels like everything that I've got a sort of I've got an angle on has already been done before, and that that's that not, that never bothered me before. But I just I, as I've sort of matured a bit, I've, I've sort of started to think, what's the point in, 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 in doing something that's been done a million times before with nothing unique? So, um, uh, so if, if you do have any suggestions, uh, leave them down in the comments. And that, that has just, just popped into my head. That, that's, that's the other thing I've been doing recently that I, I wanted to tell you that I've got really into watching crim criminal trials because I didn't realise that criminal trials in, in the in the US were were streamed live. I, I obviously the George George Zimmerman trial has, has just finished. That's got that's got a um, press worldwide really because Obama was um sort of behind it and then George Zimmerman was, was acquitted and then all. Well, all the fallout from that, the state are, uh, um, the defence are supposedly seeking sanctions from the state because of some um, misconduct that they did. And then uh, on the back burner as well, like the very, the very, fir the very first trial I watched was uh, the Jody Ewers trial, the one, the woman from Arizona who who murdered her ex-boyfriend Tra Travis Alexander, and that and that was that was an interesting case purely for. How long it went on for it? So, so, so death penalty case. You, you're probably living under a rock if you, have, if you haven't heard about it. It's been all over the media in the US. Um, uh, uh, that was just a hor hor horrific case, and the, the fact that um, she continues to talk to the media and c continues to protest her her innocence. And won't 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 acknowledge anything. Just must be all must be awful for the family. But I, I've been um very interested in trials at the moment. I I'm just I'm just about to watch the Andrea Snyder Andrea Snyder. I can't speak Andrea Snyder and um, hair did it. We a trial that's starting um. In a couple of days' time, it's it's in jury selection phase at the moment, but I, I'm just starting to watch that. I've I've started basically hopping from trial to trial, so that's um that's that. Anyway, guys, be nice be nice to hear you from down below. No, I've not stopped doing videos. I just need to get get my act together and come up with some ideas for some videos and. I'll definitely do a video near the time that I, I go to uni and the 14th of September and probably probably a, an interim video between now and then. I think I've only done two two YouTube videos so far in this whole year and it's it's nearly it's nearly we're nearly eight months into the year, so that's 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 two two videos a year so far which is Pretty abysmal. I'm sorry about that, guys. But thanks, thanks for sticking with me, and maybe we can stimulate some discussion in the comments about what is to be done in the future. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching this video. I'm going to put my website address down below, like always. Um, not much has changed on there recently, but if you've not been there before, there's some good tech articles to read there, and a couple of personal articles as well. So uh, definitely worth checking out. Anyway guys, thanks for watching this video. Subscribe if you've liked if you've liked this and hope there's gonna be more videos and you'll get them straight away when they come out. Anyway guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. I completely forgot I completely forgot to mention iOS 7 and the fact that I'll soon be investing in a new phone, but if if you if you do want um more videos.
specifically about those issues. If it's if it's something that's in demand, I can certainly address those in a video. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.